All right, made it out to uh, Marsh Park in Raleigh. Uh, it's a bit of a hike for me, like 30, 35 minute drive. Uh, I live in Durham, so that park is like 15 minutes. So a little bit longer, but uh, it's got a really great uh, little bowl area, uh, a lot of hips and spines and such, and then this really sweet ledge uh, that I'm really looking forward to skating. Um, hope to get that backside rail locked in uh, today. So. Let's see. That transition is pretty fun. My, uh, I've seen other people get some serious air out of there. So after I uh, get my legs back for grinds, I think I'm gonna have to focus on airs because it's a struggle. I've seen uh, Long and Brian just kill this. Uh, kill this line but it's pretty fun gotta gotta get out here more it's a fun park Always like to warm up with a few soul tricks. Test the ledge, see how smooth it is. Man, this thing is like butter. I know there was a session here yesterday, so you can only imagine uh, they uh, they wax the shit out of it. It's fast. You gotta love a ledge when even an alley oop sole slides like butter. Backside rails feel so good. Like, I love the feel of uh, regular Royale, but there's something about backside Royale, you just gotta squat a little bit more. Ah, it feels great. I did learn, for me at least, the trick to backside Royale. You know, after I got comfortable with that back foot, it's really just lead with that front foot. If I can throw that front foot up there, my back foot will compensate. It's really hard to put that back foot up first and then put the front foot on, but if I lead with the front, yeah, works for me. It's a nice park. I, uh, I think the ledge is much more my style than the, uh, than the bowl section, but you know, someday I'll get good and I'll be able to, to carve and do some lines in there. Uh, feeling good about Backside Royales, uh, feeling good about uh, just, you know, confident on the grinds. I think the uh, wish frames are feeling good. I think, uh, yeah, it was a good day. See you next week.